What's good, boys? Y'all want to dominate both the pass and run game in NCAA College 25? But guess what, boys? In this video, I'm going to break down the best base defense strategy y'all boys need to use to shut down your opponents. Also, I'm going to show y'all some tips and tricks and tactics y'all boys can win to stop in, you know what I'm saying, passing plays and running plays. So, let's go ahead and get into this banger video, boys. All right, boys, so right here, we are in a 3-3-5 tight uh defensive playbook and in my opinion i feel like it's the best one y'all need to be using right now and also the formation y'all want to use out of this uh playbook is called uh 335 penny and in my opinion it's the easiest and fastest blitz y'all can set up right now if it e even if you're just starting out playing this game this is the formation y'all need to be using okay so make sure i hit that like button and sub to the channel and let's get into it go to your coach adjustments so if you look at the top of my screen but when you go play a game it's gonna be at the bottom of your screen but look right here where it says coach adjustments click the right analog stick in and turn your auto flip defensive play call on off but i mean on but right here it's a visual glitch they still haven't fixed it it says on on the right side but on the left side right here it says off off means on and then when it says on off on the right side and on on the left side that means it's off so make sure y'all know that okay also what you want to do is you want to run option defense conservative conservative okay this is what i found to be the best one now for the pitch key you want to have it on aggressive i'd rather just try to stop that the, the uh the qb myself and then the other person people they play the pitch okay that way i can like click on and intercept the pitch or wherever the case may be you know what i'm saying uh, and other than that, I don't touch nothing else after that. That's remember, this is just the best base defense y'all can use right now. Okay. Next thing you want to do is make sure you have your best D lineman in the game. So before you even load up a game, make sure you know who is on this team, or just pause it and go to the depth chart. You can see who has abilities, who don't, and you can just kind of memorize and see, you know, who needs to be in the game. So like this guy, Day right here, he's a DT, but he's a 75 overall, and I have an 83 overall right in there, right here, who should be in the game. So I'm going to go ahead and put him in at the DT position and make sure my user is the best user possible for me to use. So what I mean by user is you go in this formation, you can only use a linebacker. Now, no safeties, but linebackers are good this year. So you don't have to really like just uh, go crazy saying I can't use a safety like in Madden uh, or previous years in Madden. OK, so right here, I'm going to put in my, my guy, Gulete. I think that's his name. And on this right side right here, what make what Mick Oliver is at, I'm gonna go ahead and put this guy G Bend. I think that's his name. I think he has a quick jump ability. If you don't know, quick jump is the most key ability in the game. That's the best ability y'all boys need to be using. And it's not even close. You need to be using quick jump, okay? Now, what you want to do now is come out in this play cover for quarters. But before you do that, your cover shell, it says shell, it says default. I use different ones for different formations. So if I'm going to be against five white, I go to, to cover two shell. If I'm not going to be against five white, I'm going to cover four shell and I'm coming out of cover four quarters. Okay. And let's go ahead and let's say they come out in uh trips. Trips is like the most popular formation right now. I'm not gonna say like that boys. A lot of people are using trips. And how you want to do this is very simple. It's just press Y or triangle your controller, show blitz. And then what you want to do is uh, press Y underneath and then blitz all linebackers and their user should be blitz and then slant outside, press RB guest pass and then just wait for them to snap it right here. This is just the first setup y'all boys can use. So watch right here. That pass rush is going to get there very, very easy. Take away the middle of the field and y'all should be good. Now, the second way y'all can set this up is you can show blitz once again. But you want to slide your D line to the opposite side of the hatback is on. What I mean by slide is press left for your D pad and it should say left. So it's going to say boom right there. That's how it's going to look. Blitz all your linebackers and then put your user in the zone. But if you want the blitz to come in faster, just go ahead and blitz your user. Press Y underneath so you can cancel out match coverage. Press RB guess pass once again. And now watch this right here. Watch this defense. It's going to scream once again. Okay. So this is just the fastest way and the best base defense y'all boys can use right now. In my opinion, to stop the run, the pass, anything in general. So say audible to a run, right? Say they're like, man, he's been, you know, pass committing. He's been the pressure beginning. Now I need to stop the run. So what you want to do, if you're going to begin somebody that like to run the ball, it's simply just what I like to do is, is just pinch my linebackers like this. Okay. And then sometimes I might spread my D line. If not, if I don't spread my D line, if I'm not looking to get the blitz to come in fast, I will pinch my D line and spread my linebackers, blitz all my linebackers. Okay. 
and then go ahead and put my user in the zone for some reason i don't know why but when your user's in the zone sometimes they don't get picked up when you shoot the gap so watch right here they're going to run the ball and you're going to see me right here i can shoot this gap easily and i should be able to stop him now a, a, a key tip y'all boys should know right here is when you do shoot the gap so say you do shoot the gap right here let go of the button and what i mean by is when you do shoot the gap press b or circle on your on your controller and click off of the your, your user and the computer is basically going to make that tackle so say you try to hit stick right here you can easily get juked out the cpu can too but they have a higher chance of just like tackling the person right so boom i'm gonna let go and the cpu will tackle them for me all right they just just trust the cpu more than your user okay so watch right here boys i'm gonna do the same thing it's all watch it you're gonna run the ball you're gonna audible i don't wait for him wait and then snap it hold on snap it boom i can shoot this let go and you see the cpu gets there also and that's an easy easy tackle now if you want to play a little zone coverage and mixing a little blitz remember slide your d-line show blitz blitz all linebackers i'm gonna blitz my user rb gas pass once again but we're going to do is shade underneath so you can cancel out match coverage and then what you want to do is just let's just say we put x in a vert hook right here okay say we just put them in a vert hook but remember when you put them in a vert hook you're not sending five this time you're only sending four but the good thing is you have a few quick jumps you have one or two quick jumps so the pass rush should get there a little bit fast and it should get there okay so watch right here boom boom y'all yeah, see right there that pressure still screams at the qb all right still screams and i actually think i'm using one of the quick jumps if i'm not mistaken let me go ahead and see right quick because this is a very key when you do play a game just see uh you know what players have quick jump that's the most key ability in the game so yeah this guy oh so i'm using the quick jump right guy so he should be on the line and i think i'm supposed to be user yet yeah, this is the guy oh no he's actually on the line too so he need to be on the line and this guy right here i make out of it but this guy need to be on the line i should be using some other linebacker okay so make sure i hit that like button sub to the channel hopefully this video helped y'all boys and i'll see y'all next video peace